Prince Philip coming here. Next Tuesday. Did you hear that, Mr. Brown? They're coming here, the two of them, together in person, mm. him and her, together in person. Well, calm down, Miss Courtney. Don't overexcite oh, yourself. Who's getting overexcited? I'm having a very calm about the hairy beard. <laughs> Hello? Speaking. Pardon? Is it you? Is it really you? It is you. It's him. <laughs> what, you're get, get, coming here? You, you, oh, you're not coming here. You, you are coming here. He's coming here. <laughs> half an hour. You'll be here in half an hour. He'll be here in half an hour. <laughs> oh, until then. Are you feeling all right? That was him. Yes, and he's coming here in half an hour. But who is him? I mean, who is he? Well, this is a man I never thought I'd see again. My ex fiance You mean you were actually engaged at one time? Well, there's no need to sound so surprised. <laughs> but it was, it was over 25 years ago. I mean, I mean, I was just... Well, I was very young. I met him at Oxford in the high. It was raining, he offered me shelter under his umbrella and he insisted on buying me a cup of tea and a sticky bun. How romantic. <laughs> yes, it... Uh, well, that was how it all started. Why didn't you get married? Oh, it was awful, he left me. Well, at the church? In a lurch. Oh, Mr Brown, I have never told anyone this before. Oh, well, if you'd rather not. No, sit down. Well? For years I have kept this terrible secret to myself. Now he is coming back into my life again, I feel I must tell someone, and I think I can trust you, Mr. Brown. Well, I'd rather not if it's going to cause any embarrassment. Oh, it won't embarrass me. Yeah, but it might embarrass me. No, I'm sure it won't. Well, anyway, he, um, asked me to go down to Brighton with him for one of those, you know, weekends. Oh, double room, Mr. and Mrs. Smith. Exactly. And you refused. No, I went. <laughs> I even remember the hotel. The Bella Vista, opposite the abattoir. Very Bella Vista. Well, we, we booked in, and Albert, being the thoughtful man he was, he uh, let me go upstairs first to um, prepare myself, as it were, whilst he had a drink in the bar. Getting up a bit of Dutch courage, eh? I beg your pardon. Oh, you could be such a lovely person waiting to be, um... What happened then? He didn't turn up. <laughs> he got drunk, passed out, and spent the night on a settee in the residence lounge. How despicable. Well, I went home, and I refused ever to see him again. I heard later that he was working in the Far East. But I must admit, I have always cherished a secret hope that he might one day come back. <laughs> the day my prince will come. <laughs> you feeling all right? Yes, why? It sounds as if you were in pain. I was singing. <laughs> Enter. Hello, darling. <laughs> it's you. Oh, where's... Darling! No, it's you. <laughs> yes, uh, this is Darling. Don't miss Courtney. Albert! Dolores! Dolores! <laughs> Haven't you a class to attend to? Yes, of course, Darling. Dolores. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Another cup of tea, Albert. Uh, no, thank you. Uh, Dolores. <laughs> a glass of sherry, perhaps? Uh, no, I don't drink now. I've given it up. It's a, it's a very bad habit. Oh, you're so right. I only keep it for visitors. <laughs> oh, dear. Come on, Dolores. Think of something a little more sparkling. I wonder, yes. uh, will you oh, I will. Uh, pour me another cup of tea? <laughs> tea? Uh, yes, please. But you said you didn't want any more. I've changed my mind. Oh. As a matter of fact, there is something else I want to ask. Yes? I know it may sound silly after all this time and not writing and everything, but I never forgot you, Dolores. Yes? Uh, yes. And I couldn't believe my good fortune when I discovered that you hadn't married. I never married either. Didn't you? No. Would it be too much to expect? Oh, no. I mean, would you consider? Oh, yes. I mean, will you marry me? Oh, this is so sad. <laughs> oh, no, this my cup is overflowing. Uh, uh, so is mine. Oh, so, so is mine. <laughs> 
no, 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 it doesn't matter. Um, what do you say? Will you marry me? Oh, yes, please. Uh, I get a special license and we can be married next week. So soon. Uh, well, we've already wasted 25 years. We don't want to waste any more time. <laughs> but I'm so excited. <laughs> Engagement. Uh, I got a meet a fellow down the road uh, on some business. It'll only take a few minutes, and then I shall come back and take you to dinner somewhere. Just the two of us. Yes, that would be lovely. Don't go away. <laughs> you are a woman of great perception as well as being beautiful. Oh, thank you. You are reminding me so much of your great national figure. Oh, yes, people have said I resemble the Queen. Yes, 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 no, no, not the Queen. British Bulldog. <laughs> you really must work at those R sounds. I try very hard. Try saying, round the rugged rock, the ragged rascal rag. <laughs>